hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl azine williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to this channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys so today is the birthday of the one the only banky w yes and his wife adeswa left no stone unturned as she celebrates him yes people of god so um she left this very beautiful message for him for his birthday and i'm gonna read because it's so so beautiful so she said it's my partner's birthday at Banky Wellington, my purpose partner, my life partner, a partner in every sense of the word. I thought I loved you before, but my goodness, this past year has revealed so much more about the human being that you are and my heart muscles stretch even further. Thank you, Booba. Thank you for the goodness of your heart. Thank you for the million back and foot rubs. Thank you for the love and care and attention. Thank you for all the things I can't even say out loud. Thank you for being such a p great papa. Zay and I are blessed to call you ours. Thank you for being present throughout this journey. Always by my side. You are everything I prayed for. And then some. Our son is so blessed to have such a great example. I'm always in your corner, my love. On the good days, on the bad days, on the hard days, on the easy days. I'm forever rooting for you. Forever praying for you. Forever loving you. Olubankole. Oh, this is so sweet. I mean, from thanking him to pray i'm um, praying for him this is so so sweet may we all get to experience this kind of love and from banky w and this very beautiful message from his wife we move over to singer harry's song as he formally ties the knot with his fiance alex yes so um he tied dinner today in delta state it was a, an all-white affair now that's not really the gist yeah <laughs> now isn't it has moved from lovey dovey to um the gossiping mode that is really not the gist the gist now is i'm just wondering what will now happen to that his manager remember when um harrison came out and said that he um was engaged how his former manager who has managed him for what 12 or 7 years apparently during the managerial work that she was doing there was also some other crew carry managing work that was also happening you know so um she really wasn't having it at that time she was like after all the time and this is what she gets and everything so true true now so they kick her come out. now wow hmm. anyways i even heard hmm, that uh back in 2016 our brother in the lord harry song was married like it was a secret wedding yes according to what i heard though before you people come and say that he says in it i said i would deny you they said in 2016 he had like this secret wedding that um he just like three of his closest friends that were there you know and because he didn't want everybody to be all up in his business because of his career because he didn't want to lose his female fans and all that now my question is what happened to that marriage and if something did not happen to the marriage uh judging from what his manager said at, at the time he came out to say that he was engaged was it that the manager was also enjoying him while the secret wife was enjoying him i don't know people of god if you ask me now who i go ask anyways all i can say is happy married life to him congratulations to him now away from harry song a very big congratulations to dorothy as she joins the miss k dolls yes she joins the likes of Enidima okoje and sharon onaja to be part of the miss k dolls uh she was signed as a brand ambassador for the miss k boutique and she was unveiled today now if you watch that video that dora posted you will know that this day was not even signed this month 
yeah because i remember when i saw this video it was about what last month or so whichever one congratulations to her and as she is called um agent three sharon onoja is agent zero and inidima is i think agent six if i'm not mistaken and i wonder what they are cooking whatever it is they are cooking i'm sure it's gonna be delicious and we're gonna be eating it up a very big congratulations to her now to my predo brethren yes so prince and dorothy people that have not let me rest well yes they were all two of them were at vsp botanics um okay from the pictures you can see and i also have some videos i'll put at the end of this video now should i tell you people what you want to hear or i'll just tell you my sincere um observations i'm gonna be sincere you know what i'm not even gonna tell you what you want to hear i'm gonna be sincere there is a crack in the wall in the predo ship that is if there's still a ship that is there's a very big crack in the wall and distance has crept in between these two and in as much as i love their professionalism focus focusing on the work you know doing their brand ambassador duties along with sharon onoja and all that it's really really evident that something is off between these two that is prince and dorothy i mean if you watch the um, vsp botanics live stream and you still think that all is well is be between these two people then i assure you you are living in la la land yes because the reality is something has happened between these two and it's not minor like um prince's sister put out in that whatsapp group you know as she would want us to think so yeah people of god that is it um will they resolve their issues i do not know but we pray they do nobody has actually come out with a confirmed official story about what is happening between these two both of them has kept mute about it their family members as usual has kept mute about it what we are seeing are just hearsays and really not um really not a concrete story so yeah um at this point we are just relying on ebuka to do the lost work at the reunion you know to ask them those questions because i trust ebuka he's gonna ask those questions so we will know what actually went wrong away from prince and dorothy let's move over to the one the only odogu himself burnout boy now the grammy award musician touched down his hometown Port Harcourt today and he did not just come like you know any other homecoming this one is different from every other homecoming people of God he built the river state government hundred million naira and not just that he requested that they give him a private jet that would take him from Lagos down to Port Harcourt in Nupa levels I mean he's worth it he is worth it. I mean, this is not just the burner boy before the Grammys. We are talking about the African giant. And a lot of people were like having mixed reaction. Why would he? Blah, blah, blah. My own is, my dear, he is worth it. He is worth it. I mean, he was welcomed by a very massive crowd. There were some traditional rulers, cultural displays. Even the governor himself was there to welcome burner boy. Not at the airport now. He met up with the governor later on. It was really really massive he deserves it i beg i mean his story has been one of perseverance we might not like burner boy because a lot of us might think oh he's proud and all that but people of god if you have put in so much work you know coming from a place where the people that are supposed to support you doesn't recognize you and you have to like do all those things by yourself when you now finally succeed i mean you will be a you will be proud of the work you've put in so i don't even blame him one bit he never had this easy at all he literally had to bring his own table when nobody gave him a seat at the table so a very big congratulations to burner boy so that's it from me guys thank you so very much for being part of my channel if you've not already subscribed you know what to do kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video till i come your way again i remain your girl azini williams have yourselves a beautiful day bye guys hi hi dirty let's do it it's like you don't know her <laughs> Wait. She won't snap. Ah. <laughs>
Hello. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah, the face is there. They want to see face. Come and check them to face. They want to see face. They want to see face. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember you going to do it, right?